Good morning, everybody. Today, I want to show you guys something that I, I find kind of interesting about these cows, and that is manure. So, I'm doing what they call a total graze. You can see they're mowing it completely down to the ground, just leaving about an inch of grass left. Um, and wherever they don't mow it down to the ground, like here and here, you'll find there's an old cow pie there from the last time we went around. This one looks like it's from a new cow pie and they probably smudged some, you know, they stepped in it maybe and got some poop around here. Here, they probably mowed it down first and then put down that manure. Um, here, there's a rose bush in there. Here, there's some old manure and some fresh manure, right? So when they don't, or when they, uh, the manure that they lay down is preventing them from eating all the forage that they could be. Here's another one, patch of green grass with two pats of manure in there. Probably next time when they come around, they'll eat all this grass, enough time will have passed. But from what I understand, um, the dung beetles are essential for kind of breaking down these manure pots so that they're not just sitting here hard. And I was a little worried because it doesn't seem like I have very many dung beetles that are getting rid of this. Um, so I've been looking for signs of dung beetles and I think I got it figured out. So on this pat, it's probably like a day old or something. You see, it's got all these little holes in it. I think those holes are from dung beetles. The dung beetles are pretty small. So what happens is the dung beetles will go down in there and they'll lay eggs. See, now this one's fresh. It does not have any holes in it. Dung beetles haven't gotten there yet. This one does have some holes. And so I think what happens is the dung beetles will lay their eggs in there. And then a couple days later, the eggs will hatch and the dung beetle larva will eat up the, the pads. So this is where the, they started here a couple days ago and we've been working our way down this way. Previous to going into this row, they were in this row. And so everything here is about a week old. And I'm super excited because if you look at this manure pad here, let's see it. It looks like it's all broken up and it's got these little mounds of dirt. And I believe that's all from dung beetles. I'm not sure if it's from the same variety of dung beetle. I have a suspicion that these little piles here are from one kind of dung beetle. And the fact that it's all torn up is from another kind of dung beetle. Uh, because the dung beetles that I was able to see were so small, I don't think they'd be able to move all that dirt up. But you can see all the manure pots from about a week ago. This one, it's all broken up. See, so, you know, this one's not broken up. These are, well, yeah, this is the same age as this one. This one's broken up. This one's not really broken up. Same with this one. It's not really broken up. But this one over here is broken up. This one's all broken up. This one's all broken up. So I'm, I'm pretty sure we have dung beetles that are doing their work on the farm and I'm excited to see 
next time we come around if if these will be decomposed enough to have uh, the cows grazing all around it. Man, look at this one. This one's really good. And so when it gets broken up like that, they dig little holes and they pull down the manure into the ground, from what I understand. And um, so they just pull that manure into the ground, break it up, make it the dirt more fertile and make it so that it's easier for grass to push on through there. Um, so anyway, if you would have told me a year or two ago that I'd be excited about cow manure and dung beetles, I would have been confused, but here we are. So anyway, I'm really excited to get the cows um, after they finish this row. The next row has this, this uh, Johnson grass that's just going crazy. And they love this grass. This is like, this is like six foot tall right here. I don't even want to walk in that. So they're going to love this. It's a pretty big patch of it. So anyway, there you go. You learned something, hopefully, about manure and dung beetles and cows. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Have a great day.